लोकल बुलबल मैकिंग में नवरत्नालू विथ एस टी डी एंड लोकलाइजेशन आम इट्स ए परसिस्टिंग थ्रेट ऑफ द पैंडमिक और स्टेट फेड कमिटमेंट टू एक्सटेंडिंग सपोर्ट टू वेल फायर ऑफ द फार्मर्स वीमेन चिल्ड्रेन अनप्रिवेज मार्जिनलाइज एंड बल्डर ग्रुप कंटिन्यू और फोकस रिमेन्स ऑन हाई स्टैंडर्ड्स फॉर एजुकेशन हेल्थ एग्रीकल्चर वीमेन एम्पावरमेंट एंड इंक्लूसिव गवर्नेंस the elaborate inclusive model of governance we have adopted under navaratna rule to improve the lives of our citizens is improving holistic and merits replication by other states we have implicitly adopted uns sustainable development goal broad agenda of leave no one behind under the navaratnalu framework where in all the strategies have been mapped into the state of the scheme that are implemented on a certain basis through localization of strategies by government ensuring that human and economic development takes place in a harmony with the environment the effective implementation of integrated welfare program has been facilitated by the transparent and objective mechanism of directly transferring the financial assistance into the bank account of the beneficiary without in leakages and thereby significantly improve the lives of our citizens the village and ward secretary and volunteer system that my government has established are paying this dividend by making the extension of government service transparent timely and efficient this innovative initiative has facilitated good employment generation and corruption free public service delivered at the doorstep of the citizens education a literal genius it is said resembles all though no one resembles him dr is radha krishna my government has recognized education as the most effective tool to transform the younger generation the focus is on utilizing every possible opportunity to develop its children youth to be globally competitive strengthening infrastructure components in all government schools is being implemented for a period of 3 years starting from 2022-21 under manabadi nadu nadu 2751 school in phase 1 have been completed with an outlay of rupees 3669 crores coming two years strengthening of remaining 42000 schools and other educational institutions will be taken up under this initiative my government is spending rupees 15000 crores in all these phases of manabadi nadu nadu enrollment of retention as and this is in the strategies to improve the gross enrollment ratio my government is implementing program like jagan amavodi jagan vidya kanuka jagan anna gurumudra jagan vidya divana jagan anna basti divana my government has distributed a student kit consisting of three pair of uniforms belt a pair of shoes and two pairs of socks textbooks red books work books oxford english telugu dictionary and a school bag to 47 lakh students of classes between 1 and 10 all government and government aided schools in the state 
मंडल जगह नाना भिट्टा कांड का ऑन द फर्स्ट डे ऑफ द ओपनिंग ऑफ द स्कूल इट इज ड्यू टू हर हर रेट रिटेंशन रेट जगह नाना अमावसी जी इंफॉर्मेशन माय गवर्नमेंट हैज सपोर्टेड 54.5 लाख मदर्स टू सेंडर सिंडेंट टू स्कूल आर रुपीस 13,000 23 crores have been spent under the scheme so far to address the issue of malnutrition. Among the children, my government is serving nutritious and tasty meals to 43.26 lakh children of classes 1 to 10 so far since 2019. An amount of 2,640 crores is incurred under the Jagannatha Gurumurga quality of education realizing the global importance of English language and equipping our students for 21st century skill demands my government is working to provide quality English medium education to under the academic and administrative reforms initiated by the government to improve education outcomes by providing qualified subject teachers. Schools are categorized into six types, satellite foundation school, fundamental school, functional school, plus three high schools, high school, high school plus, higher education. For the first time in the country, like in the world before, my government is implementing Jagannatha Vidya Divana scheme with the noble aim of ensuring higher education is accessible to even children for underprivileged sectors and providing full fee reimbursement to every eligible student studying B.Tech, B.Pharmacy, ITI, Polytechnic and other degree courses by paying the amount directly to the mother's account regularly with dues on quarter basis. So far, an amount of rupees 6,259.72 crores has been credited to 21.55 lakh students. Similarly, Jagannana Basati Divana scheme is being implemented to provide assistance to the eligible students for food, bread, and hostel expenses. In a first of its kind initiative in the country, the government is creating rupees 10,000 for ITI students, rupees 15,000 for polytechnic students and 20,000 for those pursuing degree and other courses in two instruments per annum to every eligible student. This facility is being extended to all the eligible students in the family irrespective of the number. Amount is directly credited to the bank account of mothers of students. So far an amount of rupees 2,304.97 crores has been credited to 18.77 lakh eligible students. Health and nutrition. The first wealth is health, Ralph Persham Emerson.